Welcome to Nasir Soft. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can select on the base of the condition a specific data from the data frame in Python. Okay, so this is my file, and inside this file, this is all the tweets that are this is the tweets, and inside this column, this is the sentiment text block result, and this is the sentiment widow result. Okay, so I only want to select uh, uh, that data okay whose both value are equal okay whose sentiment text blob and sentiment vidar both values are equal for example the first tweet is the sentiment text blob value is positive and sentiment vidar value is negative so i want to discard it i only want to select those data with both these values will be equal okay as this one i want to select this row as well okay and both are positive and both are negative and so okay this i want to discard this one basically this this tweets a sentiment text block result is positive and vidar is negative so okay so i only want to select those data whose both results are both the sentiment text block column and sentiment vidar uh, column values are same so let's code it how we can handle this thing so this is our today topic agenda so the first of all i import the pandas okay so you need to download and install the panda through pip command okay after importing the pandas library okay i read this csv file okay and the location of the csv file is this one okay and i saved it inside the data file okay so i saved this data frame inside the data file okay so now here i create a new for example variable and name it data file and condition for example okay and inside this one based on this data frame that contains all the data okay inside this one and inside this bracket here i again here i write that the, con the condition the condition is where data file and the first column name the first column name is sentiment text block again this one value is equal to copy and paste this rule here and the second column name is sentiment vidar here okay show me only those data that both sentiment text blob and vidar value will be equal and saved it inside the new data frame that is data file underscore condition and if i here print this one and the data set length for example and the second one is so how many rows will be left that will match this condition okay so if i execute this code here you can see that the there are 11867 okay rows and what are the original rows if i place here inside this original data show me okay the original data rows are 21000 okay and 282 and the resulted file based on this condition where both columns are equal are the just 11000 okay 8 and 67 you can also export this uh, new data frame inside the csv file for example if you want so here i create a variable that is csv and through the under object that is pt dot to underscore csv and inside the parentheses here write the location where you want to export the data okay for example inside the same location but now the file name is for example all common senti okay if we again execute and this is basically we can save that this data file conditions okay so therefore here this is not here this one okay so to csv convert this data frame if i again execute after some time it shows me the message that process finish if i go to the specific location here you can see that a new file is created that is all common sentiment if i double click on it here you can see that in this file all the values of sentiment text blob and sentiment vidar are equal negative negative positive positive neutral neutral 
and so on and the rows are 11868 so hope this video will help you a lot if you have any question regarding to this topic you can email me email is mentioned in video description or you can comment inside the video comment section uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel for more informative videos stay blessed have a nice day